Hey guys, Ravi here from Ira FX. I love making visual effects and animations that you find in feature films and I'll be making tutorials to each video I make. So, today we are going to learn how to do this effect. This is Superman fly effect and it is a beginner's tutorial considering the fact that you know how to use Adobe After Effects. So let's get started. Let us first divide this tutorial into three steps. Step 1 shooting the scene, step 2 splitting the shot and step 3 adding effects. In the first step all you have to do is add something like this. You have to jump into the air as if you are taking off into the sky. Also make sure that you have a clean plate of the background. Step 2. Drag the video onto the small icon here so that you create a new composition. Once that is done, go to the point where you find the clean plate of the background and click on edit, duplicate layer and uh, right click time freeze frame and you can rename the video that layer to background now select the top layer and go to the point where the character jumps from the ground and make sure you go to the frame where the character is just above the ground select the layer and click on edit split layer go to the first frame of this layer and right click time freeze frame you will now notice that this layer is freezed now click on the pen tool and you have to mask your character the masking need not be really perfect but make sure you have a clean outline of the character Once masking is done, you will be having a separate layer of your character. Now we are left with step number 3 where we have to animate our character. Select the layer and go to transform position and make sure you click this icon here so that you create a keyframe. Go a couple of frames forward and make sure you increase the Y axis and make sure that the character is out of the screen now let us see how it looks let us trim the composition and see how it looks it looks ok but if you would like to move the character a little faster you can move this keyframe a little closer to make the character look natural you have to enable this motion blur and also to the composition now you can notice that we have a motion blur effect to our character in addition to this I rendered a ground shock wave using a white solid and animating it accordingly this is how it looks and uh, you can create it yourself or you can download this project file and uh, use it in your uh, video make sure you align it properly exactly where the character starts jumping this is how the video looks once it is done you can download this project file from a website and if you are looking for more visual effects consider subscribing or you can follow me on instagram at vfxguyravi. See you next time with another tutorial.